again for joining me. In today's video, I'm going to be <clears throat> talking about a topic that is near and dear to my heart, as I think for a lot of you, and that is how to keep your hands from cracking like ice chips. Mm. I had to take a drink. <clears throat> been talking a lot to you guys today. Um, yeah, you know, with all this washy-washy, wash the hands here, wash the hands there. How many times are you guys washing your hands in a day? Seriously, I, I lose count. I absolutely lose count. I'm so OCD about it. You know, of course, bathroom runs, going outside, walking the dog, going shopping for groceries, running back in, um, coming into contact with anything, anything in the public environment. I am like OCD about hand sanitizer or washing my hands when I get a chance to get near water and soap. So with that said, um, it's been rough. It's been rough, guys, on the hands. It really has been rough on the hands lately. Not to mention, I even took off my nail. Look at this. I have no nails on. I took off all my nails. I just, you know, I'm at home. Nobody cares. I'm not showing it off to anybody. Uh, I'm not at work. So it, it's, you know, with all the hand washing and all the detergent and all the disinfectant and all the spraying down the counters and all the sanitary wipes and everything else, my, my fingers are cracked, my nails, everything. It was just, it was not pretty, not pretty. So I am going to run through some of the things that I'm using for my hands right now currently to keep them hydrated as best I can. There's one that I couldn't find simply because I think my son took it. Uh, so that one I will put a picture, you know, somewhere up here and talk about that. But all the other stuff I have gotten uh, from upstairs, I brought it down here. So let's get started. All right. Uh, the number in no particular order okay first of all no particular order second i'm not being sponsored by any of this so you know this is only what i'm using um and again i'm not a doctor or dermatologist so you do you if you have uh certain skin conditions um eczema or anything like that please consult with your doctor before putting anything on your hands or anything on your skin okay disclaimer um one of the things I absolutely love is the Gold Bond Ultimate Healing Hand Cream. Absorbs in seconds, absolutely true. Lasts through hand washing, absolutely true. And it's got vitamin B, C, and E in it. Seven intensive moisturizer. Uh, Non-greasy, light, fresh scent. There you go. I have been using this for, oh, forever and a day. I won't be out. I won't be without it in my house let's put it to you that way and it's supposed to last you like 24 hours now i don't i don't believe in all that but it does last you through some hand washing so if you put this on in the morning and you're out there and you've got to you know sanitize your hands or wash your hands or anything you do feel like almost like a little film like a protective film on your hands uh, so it does last you quite a while and uh, in today's environment you absolutely need something like this so this is one of my you know top top picks H hand cream at night ta-da again I won't li leave live live I won't live without having this okay this is the blue tub, I call it the blue tub versus the white tub of Nivea. Nivea has two different varieties. One is the um, lighter cream, like a lotion-y lighter cream. It's in a white tub. It's, I think it's called soft cream. And then the other one is the heavier cream, which is the dark tub, which I love. There you go. Um, still have quite a bit of this. This is a very heavy, heavy, heavy heavy moisture cream in fact I'll put some on right now to show you guys it is just so hydrating oh I love it love it it you feel that moisture penetrating your skin you feel it you know that that cracked skin right now the dry skin it is just loving on it I look forward to Nivea at night I honestly do I do like a little mini 
massage of my hands, my fingers, my thumb, all the way up to my wrists, like right about here. Uh, I put some even on my elbows. I mean, I absolutely love Nivea. That is, if I could, if I could say holy grail on any of this, I would say Nivea. If I, if I could only have one of these, I probably, for cream, I probably would have the Nivea. Now, the oil is a different thing. We're going to get to the oils, but uh, for cream, I would I would say Nivea is my hands hands down number one. Okay, uh, this other one I picked up. This is really nice. It's like a it's like an English or French. It's called Brompton and Langley. So I'm thinking it's from oh it's from Canada. So yeah, English derivative. You know, Englishy. It's from Mississaugas where they make it. Uh, so hi to my uh, Canadian brethrens and sisterins, um, you know, if you're watching me. Uh, this is called Green Tea and Jasmine Luxurious Hand Cream. It's got shea butter in it, a um, whole 10% of shea butter in it. And I got this at Steinmart for like $3.99 there. I don't know if you see the label there, $3.99. I really like this. Uh, this is just a beautiful, beautiful kind of has that old-fashioned you know with the tube it smells really nice I just put a little on there there you go a little dabble do me I'm all about I have no worries using hand cream on on camera right now because I can't get enough on my hands so I'm like any chance I get I am putting hand cream on so this is again a very luxurious a uh, very hydrating feel to it. it goes right in onto your hand it's absolutely marvelous there we go um, it has a slight floral you know smell to it very slight nothing uh, heavy uh, again a really nice I could use this for the day and I can use this for the night day cream or night cream <clears throat> I do prefer using the creams at night uh but that doesn't matter you know i would i would put this on in the day too uh my bond my gold bond one i do do a lot during the day because when i go out that's what i use so mm, yum okay now i've got three oils uh that i chose for you guys and then um I do want to make mention of the Aqua 4, so let's not forget that one. The Aqua 4 is really, really good. It's a consistency of Vaseline, and again, you can use Vaseline as well. So if you want to pick up a jar of Vaseline and start putting it on your hands, absolutely 100% acceptable. That is an awesome, awesome uh, hydrating, you know, type of texture to have on your hand. But uh, aside from the Vaseline, you can also get Aquaphor, which is wonderful. It comes in a tube. Uh, again, my, my son F-scammed with it somewhere, so it's in the house here, but I didn't have time to go looking all over the house for it um, because he has like little dry hands and patches, so he uses that sometimes. Uh, but I love Aquaphor as well. Okay, for oil, I've got three here, and I'm um, looking at them. No particular order, so I'm just going to... Uh, pick this one up now this one you can use obviously on your face but I use it on my face and on my hand it's the derma e anti-wrinkle vitamin a and e treatment oil and that's that I've had this forever a little goes a long way uh, I've yet to make a dent in it guys because I do cycle around so I don't use a lot of you know the same products like exclusively I've had this maybe a couple of months now um, and I think I got it at uh, Sprouts, yes. I don't know how much it was though. Uh, but yeah, this is a really good anti-wrinkle vitamin E, vitamin A and E oil. Skin renewing vitamin A helps diminish the look of fine lines and wrinkles. Okay, yeah, not a big thing on your hand. Uh, skin healing vitamin E helps promote soft, smooth, and supple skin. Now that is true. Uh, and it says to use morning, evening, uh, you know, so you can use it at any time. Very little ingredients in it. Sapphire, safflower seed oil, uh, retinol, retinol uh, palmitate, which is vitamin A, and tocopherol acetate, which is vitamin E. So a very, very simple, simple formula. Very simple formula. 
very hydrating. Uh, again, this is oily, so you might want to use this at night or while you're at home. You probably don't want to use it during the day because it can be oily and slippery. It does take a while to, you know, soak into your skin. It's not like uh, some of the lighter uh, hand creams that are made to absorb immediately. Now, getting even heavier than that is the castor oil. Uh, this is by Heritage Store, Home of Christie Castor Oil, and it's pure cold press, top quality oil, soothes the skin, everything, everything. Castor oil is like, you can't go wrong with castor oil. Castor oil is for so many things for your skin, it's not even funny. I mean, you can use it on your face, you can use it on your feet. Oh my gosh, you could use it on your heels, your cracked heels on your feet. Uh, of course, your hands, back of your hands. You can use it for your um, nails to uh, have it as a nice lubricating uh, cuticle oil. Castor oil is wonderful for that. Uh, people do use it for their eyelashes to grow, eyelash, you know, to hydrate and grow your eyelashes. I used to do that. I find it a little goopy for my eyelashes, so I kind of stopped using that, as I discussed in another video uh, that I'll be posting up here. I do use an actual um, eyelash boosting serum now, so I don't use, you know, castor oil. But a lot of people have had success with their eyelashes, you know, growing them. But back to hands. It's great for your hands. It's a it's a very, very thick oil. Okay, there's a tiny drop, if you guys can see that. There, it's right on the palm of my hand. And uh, I'll just put it in there. It um, Castor oil doesn't glide as well as like vitamin E oil does or vitamin A oil. It does have a, a very, almost like syrupy, sticky feel to it. So uh, yeah, it's definitely something you wanna put on at night. Maybe even put some cotton gloves on your hands uh, once you put the castor oil on there and then just sleep with your gloves on, on your hands so it gets really in there. It's a very deep, hydrating, uh, nourishing and repairing type of oil. This is more almost like, wow, you really need to repair your skin because it is cracking. It is really, really bad. Uh, castor oil will do it every time. You will wake up the next morning and you won't believe how wonderful your skin is from castor oil. Okay, and the last one I wanted to talk to you guys about is jojoba skincare oil. Again, you can use this for your face. Most of these oils, guys, are multi-usage, okay? You can use it for your face, your hands, your feet, dry patches, things like that. Jojoba oil is also wonderful for your um, for your hair. A little top, a couple of drops, you know, put it in the palm of your hand, hand to warm it up and put it in your hair. It's wonderful for that. Again, I use it for multi, multi reasons. Um, putting another, another little one on here. Uh, I'm just, I use it for everything, but also for the back of my hands. I won't keep putting stuff on the back of my hands. You get the picture, it's oil. Uh, and it is uh, not tested on animals, 100% pure botanical ingredients, no synthetic ingredients, paraben and petroleum free. And uh, ingredients, organic jojoba oil. That is it. It's by Aura Cassia Pure Essential Oils. There you go. Again, I'm not, you know, I'm not getting any uh, uh, sponsorship or anything from it, from any of these. I just want to show you what I use and what my choices are. You can choose any other jojoba oil. You know, as long as it's pure, organic, uh, those kind of things. You want to make sure that you're uh, getting the best bang for the buck. Uh, none of these break the bank. They are very, um, I think the most expensive maybe is the Derma E, the vitamin A, vitamin E uh, oil. Um, the jojoba, I would say it's under $10. The castor oil is certainly under $10. Um, the Nivea is, you know, maybe 4 or $5 if that. Uh, and then the Gold Bond hand cream is very reasonable too. You can get it at uh, that you can get at, uh, I've seen at Walmart, Walgreens, CVS, I've seen it all around. So anyway, these are my choices. It doesn't really matter um, 
what brand you're using just get a couple of these i would suggest if you can to get a an actual oil and to get an actual cream so get at least two varieties um, again if i would have to pick the creams it would be either the nivea or the gold bond hand cream the aquaphor also wonderful wonderful i can't i really can't make up my mind i i think all three of them are just equal in my mind as far as um rehabilitating your hands and then for the oils uh again any one of these oils are wonderful uh if you have really really damaged hands really really damaged cracked parched hands uh i would go for the castor oil if it were my choice uh followed by the jojoba jojoba you can use on your um you know you can use on your face and all over so and your hair as well so uh i hope this has been valuable information to you guys i hope you guys are keeping healthy and well and uh, social distancing and washing your hands and doing all the things that you're supposed to do um hopefully by the time this video airs we'll be opening up uh, some of the businesses around town um, I'm really keeping my fingers crossed that we're not going to be holed up that much longer I know a lot of these businesses are suffering big time big 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 time and a lot of you guys are um, unemployed right now or furloughed my husband is actually furloughed too so um, he's been you know just hanging out and uh, sitting around and stuff um, helping out with housework but uh, basically uh, not having a job right now but um, hopefully he's you know just furloughed so he will he'll be picking back up again uh, in another you know couple of weeks so that'll that's a blessing uh, but keep well um, you know I know it's hard to do not to stress about things but uh, it's it's just it's so poisonous to our system to be so uh, wound up and stressed and have so much anxiety all the time uh, please try to do maybe some meditation or if you can go outside if the weather permits and if you can social distance try to get some fresh air uh, just a few a few minutes of sunlight fresh air anything like that to boost your mood uh, that's very very helpful anyway blessings to everybody I love you guys, each and every one of you. Please leave your comments below. Please share this video to anyone that would need this information. I would sure appreciate it. And if you can give it a thumbs up, I'd really appreciate it. I love you very much, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.